everyone, welcome back to another episode of Web Tech Tutorial. In today's tutorial video, I'm going to help you learn how to sign up for an Apple ID. Keep watching the video till the end without skipping in order to learn how and subscribe to our channel by hitting the subscribe button. Press the bell icon so that you'll never miss another update from us. Now start by clicking open a web browser and in the search box type in Apple ID create and search. Now click on the first link that you see that says create your Apple ID. And you'll end up to this page where you can register for a new Apple account. Enter the first name in the first text field you see. Now, move on to the next text field and type in your last name. Select your country or your region from the drop-down next. And then enter your birthday information on the next. Now, go ahead and enter an Apple ID for you. This will be your new Apple ID. After typing an Apple ID you want to use for your account, go to the next field and type in a password for your account. After you type in your password, you can move on to the next step. In order to create a password, make sure your password includes these criteria mentioned below. Once you do that, go ahead and enter the password one more time in order to confirm it. And then go ahead and select your country code and enter your phone number. While entering a phone number, make sure to enter a phone number which you always have an access to and it will be used to verify your identity anytime you sign in with a new device or a web browser. You can choose for your verification from the options over here. If you want to receive a verification through a text message, then check this text message circle. If you want to receive phone calls, then check on this phone call option. If you don't want to receive announcements, recommendations and updates about Apple products, make sure to uncheck this box. If you do, leave it as it is. Same goes for the next one as well. If you don't want to receive new releases about the special offers and recommendations, then you can uncheck this box and move on to the next field where you'll need to enter a character that has been given in this box right here. Type down the character that you received and finally click on continue. You'll need to verify your email address in order to create a new Apple ID. Go ahead and check your email. And soon after you do that, you'll be able to create an Apple account for yourself. I hope the tutorial was helpful to you. If it was, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Feel free to comment down below in the comment box if you have a question or a feedback for us. I'll be back soon with more tutorial episodes. Goodbye till then.